Hey guys, it's Tanil from Paper Milkshake and welcome back to my channel. I'm falling very far behind with my pocket advent calendar and opening them. So today is actually the 19th of December and I haven't even opened 17, 18, the 19th. So let's jump straight to number 17. And Diane has sent me a, another um, shaker pocket with lots of beautiful sequins in here. This time she's included a lot of blues. Um, there's some indigo in there, there's some turquoise and some teeny weeny tiny little um, baby blue trees. Um, there's also some iridesc iridescent sequins mixed throughout here. So very cute little mix and I already have a project in mind for that. So um, watch this space. And then I have another pocket here on the 18th and this one contains, I think the word is mica. Um, basically it's I guess a type of sequence that's meant to look a bit like snow um, and can be used basically on any shaker cards or greeting cards um, as, as fake snow. So I haven't used it before, I've never used this type of material before, but I'm looking forward to being creative with it. Then on the 19th, uh, there is a, looks like a little pocket in here. And inside she has um, two giant Christmas colored paper clips. I don't know where people find these giant paper clips, but um, I like to use them to make like little embellished banners or even to add like a little pom pom or something of interest on the top of the paper clip to alter it. Thank you. I really like everything, Diane, and I will see you guys tomorrow. Hey guys, it's the 21st of December today and I didn't realise I was such a floozy that on the 18th Diane actually gave me another package um, as well as the little um, sequence that she packed for me. Um, Diane made this beautiful Traveller's Notebook cover which she, sh which she sewed with this gorgeous like peppermint pink cover and she's put a beautiful like gold elastic around it and just look at the beautiful charms that she's detached on like it's so stunning I love it so much it's so fun and pink and red and oh, it's just so beautiful like look at the charm I I don't know if she made these polymer clay charms herself but they are the cutest little things got a little face on them and little pink cheeks and just yeah, it's just so pretty. She's added some pom poms, little pom pom charm there, and these beautiful, like, iridescent hearts and gold bells. I love it so, so, so much, Diane. And I want to so. Okay, so opening the Traveller's Notebook, the inside is this beautiful red spotted paper. It's really, really festive. I didn't do December daily this year because I've just been so busy, but I will certainly do one next year. And Oh, you know what? I might just use this as a memory keeper for all the photos that I take this December and add them to my Traveller's Notebook. So, thank you so much. So, back to the album itself. Yes, Millie? Can you give me some more now? Yeah, I'll come and give you some more in just a sec. Down. So having a look at the 21st, actually we haven't even opened the 20th, have we? Um, there's the 20th, so um, it's this beautiful pattern paper again with the holly berries. And I'm guessing she's got another dye in there for me. So, yep, it's another mini dye. And it's this beautiful floral piece. I love dies that are in shapes that are not square or circle, but I like different patterns and shapes because they're really good to layer onto my projects, especially my memory decks card. So yeah, gorgeous little, little die there. And 21st is this package. Yep, so she's got a bit of ribbon at the top. Leah, do you want to help me undo that ribbon? Pull that little, gently pull that ribbon off for me. Hey, sweetheart, I'm coming. Okay, and we're going to take this prism out. And we're going to open it. Mommy. Hang 
on, sweetheart. I'm almost done. Do this one handed again. Feels like chocolate, Millie. Really. What do you think? Yeah. It is. Oh no, it's. Let's have a look. Beekeeper Manuka honey and bee pollen and puffed amaranth. It is chocolate and it's crafted in Dunedin where Diana's from. This sounds delicious. So it looks like it's some kind of dark chocolate that contains New Zealand Manuka honey with bee pollen and I'm not sure what amaranth is but it should be very tasty. Should we try this chocolate later Millie? Yeah? Can I have some now? Well I think you can have some after breakfast. Let's go finish our breakfast.